Hey, what's up and welcome back everyone to another Warzone video. In today's video, we are telling you the statistically fastest time to kill gun in all of Warzone right now. No exceptions, no clickbait. This gun absolutely fries. So in the background, you're going to be seeing two back-to-back -back 20 bombs in solos of me using this gun and just falling in love all over again because I forgot this thing even existed. Now, the gun we're talking about today is the AS Val. And before you go anywhere, let me just remind you, the reason we don't see this gun is because it's really only viable in solos and duos. That's mainly what I play on stream. I play solos, I go through a lot of solos coaching, or I'm just playing with one of my buddies. All of the pros and content creators that we're watching are just set up in absolute god squads, and they're rocking SMGs because you really need a big, you know, capacity SMG to run trios and quads. But I get away with so many sketchy gunfights with this gun just because of its absurd time to kill and the longer damage range before a drop off. The AS Val got me out of so many positions where I should have lost, where I either chowed late or someone got the jump on me. So, real quick. Let me show you the statistics to back it up and the build that I'm using. And you're going to see some gameplay that is absolute hilarity with how much this gun fries. But before we get into this, if you guys enjoy the style of video where I show you the guns you need to use, the loadouts to run them, the stats to back it up, and then the gameplay to prove that it's just as good, make sure to drop a like on this video. Subscribe if you want to do uh, see more and do me a favor. Let me know down below in the comments. We're kind of in a dry spell with Warzone right now. If you're interested in seeing multiplayer content, let me know. This is typically a Warzone channel, but we really don't have much Warzone coming on until really Vanguard integrates on December 2nd. So if you're interested in it, please let me know down in the comments. But without further ado, the screen is going to go white. Watch your eyes. So over on this page, we have Jay God's stat sheet. This is available in the description. He builds all these out, keeps them constantly updated. And I don't know where I've been thinking, but the AS Val is the single fastest killing gun in the game at 475 millisecond time to kill. That's even faster than the Thin Adverse, which only kills at 543. And even the only gun that technically beats it is the Akimbo M19s, but that's two guns and it's hip fire. Like you're not going to get a consistent time to kill out of two hip fire guns, but you are out of an AS Val, and especially with the build that I'm about to show you. So. First and foremost, most of the builds that you guys are seeing aren't really sane in my eyes. They, they don't make a lot of sense. And even Jay God, I don't really agree with his build, um, but maybe he knows something I don't. Or maybe he just hasn't updated in a while. But let's take a look at this. This is from True Game Data. Once again, linked in the description. You can test all of the guns and their individual attachments. The base drop off doesn't hit until 30 two meters most of your favorite guns like the mp5 and the ots drop off at 13 or less so you're getting a huge drop off even shooting on the other side of a room this on the other hand can shoot like down the block before the first damage drop off hits so the way that i'm building this gun is right here i'm building it all for a sniper support mid-range fastest aim down sight as possible and because we have a base damage drop off of 30 meters i'm not going to carry this gun and slow it down with a longer barrel because 30 meters is plenty enough. It's past 30 meters. Frankly, I probably feel pretty comfortable quick scoping. So I've got a tack laser, 30 round mag for that max mag capacity, the stippled grip. This will help me with my faster aim down sight speed and a faster sprint to fire speed. Slide of hand to just in case I get into multiple engagements and the GI mini reflex because I'm aiming down sight on this gun. I see some people building it with Merc 4 grips and 5 milliwatts like you have 30 rounds. Don't trust hip fire to get the job done for you. Rock that mini reflex, use it as a mid range, and you are going to be beaming people. In the video today, I actually rocked the Strelic stock, but after the Skelet stock, but after doing some reading and after doing some studying over here on True Game Data, once again, it's not really worth it. Uh, I would much rather have stippled grip tape. The ADS is 17 milliseconds versus 13 milliseconds. You're not going to feel that. Aim down sight movement speed plus 17%. That's actually quite a lot. So you are going to feel that and that may actually be beneficial to you. But I think I would opt for the stippled grip tape just because it's going to allow me to get that sprint to fire in a little bit quicker if I'm trying to clear out a building. So that's your call. If you want that faster aim down sight movement speed, stick with the stock. If you want that faster sprint to fire speed, stick with the stippled grip tape. But without further ado, we're going to jump into the today's video and just show you two back-to-back -back highlight reels of me running through, sniping like an absolute maniac and running through these lobbies. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do me a favor, drop a like if you do. Reminder, comment down below if you want to see some multiplayer gameplay. And as always, follow me over on Twitch if you want to catch this gameplay live. It's still hitting me. Enjoy. Well done. 
Oh! Oh! Okay. Where the heck did that guy come from? How do I not hear that? How do I not hear any footsteps? Time to earn your freedom. Nope, that guy did not have daddy. Does anyone need this? Dropping in late right there. Wow. I wonder where he just dropped in from. I'll drive. I'll drive. All right, passenger. He's not going to like that one. Nakatomi, maybe this guy right here. Wow. So it kind of fries. Am I the hacker in the lobby? Is it me? Be advised, UAV is being over RTB for resupply. Well. What do you think, chat? We got a we got a truck up there. We got a custom vehicle skin on it, and it's perched up on top of a high ground. What are the odds someone's camping up here? Probably in here, yeah. Oh, even better. Log Parrot. Be advised, UAV is being go fuel. RTB for reason. I'll drive. 
<laughs> oh, I'm, 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 I'm mean for that. And they don't like me. Well. I'll drive. Did it to yourself, man. Wow. That's gonna blow up. It shouldn't kill me. Nice. I was just trying to get behind that wall, too. That sucks. Right here? What? That's a little bit of desync right there. It's too early in the game to be... to be taking all of your fights from the high ground and camping like that. Isaac, let's not miss those in the future. I purposely didn't try to run him over because I wanted to get an AS Val kill. Because if I don't, because if I run, if I run one single person over in a lobby, everyone's like, what? Did you see at three minutes and 45 seconds, uh, that guy that got ran over, he was a bot. Win here and you return to the front line. But if you lose, you're done. Time to Gunny. Mm, might want to work on a rebrand there. God. Rats! No way, bro. Yes, way, bro! Put down the RPG, Timmy. Tristan, you gotta take the fight, buddy. You gotta take the fight. I know it's scary, but you gotta take the fight sometimes. But stuff like that, like an OTS could never accomplish that. Like, I typically run OTS Swiss. But like, I would be going for quick scopes right there rather than actually pulling out my um, OTS, because the OTS would never beam from range. Friendly loadout drop on the way. <laughs> I do kind of miss playing with a gun with a tack laser. It just looks cool to aim down sight with a tack laser. I wonder if they're going to do the same thing to Van like Cold War weapons that they did whenever Vanguard, like the same thing to Cold War weapons that they did to Modern Warfare weapons whenever Cold War was released. A lot. Because whenever Cold War released, they basically nerfed all Modern Warfare weapons into Oblivion. I guess they didn't nerf, it's just that the Cold War weapons had significantly better, and significantly better, um, aim down sight. Not aim, well, aim down sight too, but ADS strafe speed and base movement speed. You were zooming with those guns compared to Modern Warfare weapons. Ever since Cold War came out, I feel like if I'm using a Modern Warfare weapon, I'm in stuck in quick scan. Even the AS Val, like... 
only reason it's somewhat forgivable is because of its unbelievable time to kill. All right, this guy's coming down below. They came out first. Three wraps. Gotta come in here. Oh. Dead. Well, the guy's still sitting on the corner. My reload didn't finish. Still up there sitting on the corner. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. RTB for resupply. Enemy UAV overhead. Yes, sir. It's a solos only gun for the AS valve. Maybe duos if you're if you're playing tight with your other duo. Oh no. No. Oh no. Pop gun. Sorry, Bruno. I know, sons, they're not fair. Complain to the devs, maybe they'll remove them. They don't listen to me. Hey, I'm on pace for two back-to-back -back 20s with the AS foul. I can't believe I forgot about this gun. Request recon. Thirty-seven left, dude. Why are these lobbies getting torched? It was just like last game, man. Twenty, like la last game, we had twenty players left. Whenever the circle closed, it's insane. Right, we got two players here. I think both are ghosted. One's inside of this shed. He was pointing above, so he's probably. Upper levels. Break that so I can get my one shot headshot. Okay, so we're wall banging. We're wall banging. Keep an eye out for the third party. Thought that was him. It's not. Gone. Zooming. Out of there. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. <clears throat> Get up. See, like that, I would normally have to rely on like Enemy a crazy quick scope. Hello? But what, the, we said the damage fall-off was 32 meters? That's this far away, before it even slightly starts to fall off. That's why we don't have to rock a barrel. This could be a heater. Request recon flyover. UAV entering the AO. Come back, come back from the jailbreak. Come back. Does anyone need this? Positive ID on the bounty target. Sort them out. I am so glad I did not die to that RPG. I would have lost full. Mmm, that second one was super close. See if we can take this ridge line once we do. We'll pop UAV for info. Uh, it's still, still pretty far back. I'm gonna Request pop it. Close, dude. UAV entering the AO. It's gonna have to wrap out. But I don't want to, like, hold him while I'm getting held by Enemy the gas. Alright, so I'm going to try to beat the gas a little bit. And now I have time to play slow. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. RTB for resupply. Uh. 
go. Bounty target is down. Well done. No, please put the mask away. Let's go. If you use the 30 bullets and you need to reload, you just chunk so much damage off of them just by getting one or two bullets in them because the, the damage per bullet is insane. Request recon flyover. UAV entering the AO. Okay, you got two cars down there. Nothing on UAV. Only bad thing about the AS foul. I'm not even complaining about the mag size. Is the movement. So it it it's kind of I don't want to say it's a power position gun like a shotgun. Because you can still use it in mid range, right? Like if I'm here and someone chows this, I feel confident with an AS foul. Without it, you'd have to chow like a quick scope. Bounty target identified. Slot the bastard. And most people don't feel comfortable doing that. So running sniper SMG feels uncomfortable. I haven't used the AS Val since the nerf. I mean, it got nerfed, but still, like, I think it's the fastest killing gun in the game besides the. UAV entering the AO. Got a decent hit fire, too. I think it's the fastest killing gun in the game besides the uh, Kimbo M19s, which I wouldn't even consider to be a gun, right? Like. You're relying on hip fire. I don't really appreciate when people call it like, oh, M19s are the fastest. Yeah, good luck getting those bullets to line up, man. All right, making a hard cross right now just to try to get in this divot. Still can't believe after all these seasons, there's only one way up there. Hmm. Not sure where to go. Before I cross this road, I'm just gonna clear out all the attics. Look for anyone that might gatekeep me. Love that. Enemy UAV overhead. Wait, I don't have an in on this keyboard. <laughs> okay, I think I see a guy in the window. I do. Okay, so we got a guy there. Yep. Nothing in these buildings close. Definitely have someone over here. All right, he's probably camping in here. Contract time expired. No. We lost the target. There's a fresh truck right there. That building's gonna get pushed out. I mean, shoot, I I I got like zero info off of that. Might end up making a play. That's the guy we're looking for. I think I'm gonna make a play for the truck, and then use the truck for the end game. Gulag's closing. A little late loady pop. I'm gonna check for traps. Looking for proxy mines. Nothing in it. Full health truck. We love that. Oh wait, he rotated out. Did he? Is he lower? Chat. Mad. 
Because bad. Moving. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. RTB for resupply. Bro, you, you gotta you gotta jump. You you're gonna have to move. Uh, you know what? I'm just setting up to kill this guy. I'll drive. I was gonna try to quick scope him, or, like as he was coming in, but. that other building. I have a durable? Oh my. Oh my, we hit those. I'll drive. Two left, one in the attic probably of this building. Oh my god, bro. That was gross. We got a second place 22 kills and then a first place 21 kills. Back to back. Oh my goodness. <laughs>